I think they really deserve the prize and uh, they led the foundation in an important way to the more recent development of the area. Black holes are the origin of the universe's most powerful electromagnetic radiation, with jets of high-energy electrons and magnetic fields. Roger Blanford's theoretical work deals with the violent processes behind this strong radiation, and he answered the question of how the powerful radiation and energy from the matter around rotating black holes is created. Early in his career, Roy Kerr made one of the most important theoretical discoveries in modern astrophysics and cosmology, a mathematical description of rotating black holes. He succeeded in solving Albert Einstein's equations for black holes that could possibly be found in the universe. What uh, Roy Kerr discovered was the solution of the uh, rotating black hole. And that solution had quite some interesting structures. It had several event horizons um, and outside the hole was this ergosphere as it's called. Uh, that's uh, accessible, visible from the outside. If you have an object there you see it move more rapidly around the black hole than you would expect it to do. And that's because the whole space-time is swept around by the rotating black hole. Um, and so by observing matter close to the black hole you can actually show how space and time is affected by the black hole itself. That's fundamentally important. Roger Blanford made this mathematical model to real physics. First of all it was realized in the end of the 60s that uh, matter falling in towards the black hole would be structured, would be uh, circling the, encircling the black hole in a so-called accretion disk before it falls in. And this accretion disk is a very hot and very, very energetic object and it may have magnetic fields or is supposed to have magnetic fields in it. These magnetic fields in the accretion disk uh, due to the rotation of the accretion disk and the effects on space-time by the, the rotating black hole, the magnetic fields are wired together in, in ropes and uh, there are effects due to infalling matter leading to lots of radiation and a cascade of electrons and antiparticles coming out and radiation which may be uh, channeled through these flux ropes out in huge jets far far away from the central black hole. Roger Blanford has contributed more than uh, almost anybody in putting physics into the Kerr solution to understand that the rotating black hole as a mathematical object really leads to fantastic physical consequences. We can also be observed as these radio galaxies and, and uh, quasars. Uh, this physics is difficult and intricate and he has systematically worked on how this could uh, work and I think that is a very important contribution. So uh, one could say that uh, Roy Kerr put up the skeleton, the mathematical skeleton, and uh, Roger Blanford and many others, but not the least him, or very much him, put flesh onto these bones, and now we see a, a living creature here. 